said she was coming at 12. I couldn't get a bus, Julie. Uh, Nearly 25 minutes I stood outside Davenport. The queue went right round the corner. Do you get wet? Look at me. Give your coat. I'll, I'll get you a towel. Where's Ryan? Oh, back at the sofa. Oh, you don't want to leave him there, Julie. I oh, don't leave him there, Mum. Ryan! He gets there on his own. I had him on the floor with his bricks. Only as soon as I turn my back, he's round there again. Where is he? Where is he? <gasps> there he is. What you doing down there? You shouldn't be sitting in all that muck. Come on. Come to Granny. Oh, yes. Oh, you don't want to be down there. You come up and sit with me. You come and sit on Granny's lap. That's better, isn't it? Yes, it is. Now you're sitting with Granny. <laughs> when did you last change him, Julie? Just before you came. Well, you can't have done. He's all wet. Mum, don't tell me what I've done and what I ain't done. I changed him 20 minutes ago. Well, he's wet now. He's all wet, isn't he? He says, I'm all wet and I want a nice clean nappy on my body, don't you? Of course it does. That is about the fifth time this morning. I reckon there's something wrong with him. Well, you want to get him down the doctor's. Yeah. I mean it, Julie. He shouldn't be doing that. Well, I know. How long has this been going on? What? The wetting, I don't know. A couple of weeks. Well, I only noticed it yesterday because I had to get some more pampers and I thought... Well, that's weird. I only got a new lot on Monday and today's Wednesday. Well, there you are then. You know what this is, don't you? Mrs. is dead. Do you miss your dad? <coughs> God be you do. He says, I want my dad. My dad gone off and left me all on my own. Pack it in, Mummy. He ain't saying that. Well, he would if he could talk. Yeah, well, he can't talk, can he? Yeah, you don't know what they think. Well, he ain't thinking that. Oh. <laughs> Here we are. <laughs> oh, boo! Oh, boo! <laughs> Julie's going to get you a nice, clean nappy. <laughs> You're going to put the kettle on, Julie? Yeah. And then we're all going to have a nice cup of tea. <laughs> she thinks Dean's coming back. She does, you know. But we know better, don't we? <laughs> He's not coming back. He's gone for good. He don't care about you. Don't care about her. He don't care about nobody but himself. Always has. He's rubbish. I told her when she went with him, but she wouldn't listen. There's some rolls in my bag, Julie. Your dad's a nasty piece of work. You're better off without him. You mark my words. You stay with Granny and Mummy. <laughs> Ryan. See? So you two left. Oh, well, I've got to go down safe ways later. I'll get you some. Ryan. Come to Daddy. Come on. Come on, Ryan. Zeg. I'll put them on a the plane. Now, don't you start all that, Julie. You've lost nearly a stone since Dean went. Any more of this and it'll be you down the doctor's.
Ryan. Ryan, come on. Come on, Ryan. Come with Daddy. Come on. <laughs> Who's a good boy? He's only round the back of the sofa again. Oh, Mum, Mum. He's only round the back of the sofa, sofa, back of the sofa again. <laughs> you want to put that fire guard there, Julie, then he won't be able to get round. Will ya? No, you won't. <laughs> Mum. <laughs> Ryan. 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 Ryan.